Sora? Are we gonna really see Sora? Oh, okay. I was not ready for the Sora. So, we're getting Sora. Starting it off, kind of just neutral. Both players looking for the opening, and if we're gonna get the first opening, Fox most any moves at this percent will combo. Now, not really looking for the up air, missing the other up kill and getting punished for it a little bit. Now this neutral is just kind of them running around, waiting for their moment, and Roxy getting the first one in with the dash attack. If it's a good jump, so I need to recognize that you're most likely gonna go for the Blizzaga. Now both of them just kind of jumping, waiting for the opening, start looking for their combo opener. There we go, Rocks are gonna, not going to get the follow-up off of it. But still, it's just all a little chip they've kind of been doing to each other that's been adding up good amount. Nothing like real combo heavy. They're both kind of scared though, They're rolling, Rox is doing a lot of rolling away, with, like rolling behind. I wonder if it's going to recognize that eventually, that it's just kind of been rolling in neutral. And maybe he's going to bait out that roll. Killing off the top. Wow. And Roxa taking the early lead in this matchup. Or oh, maybe he doesn't like it. Fox Kazi is kind of bad for Kazi. That makes sense now. Think of it. But he's getting a little chip in. 25% so far. If we're looking for his kill, probably looking for that Nair up air. Up smash. Or even just a straight up air will kill. Back air maybe at ledge. I grab. I don't know. I don't know if that forward smash was meant, but now it's 56% racked up. 60, 70, yeah, and Kondaga coming down, missing this time, fortunately for Ifrit. But Ifrit's still trying to find that kill, and he's just trying to find that stray hit. Fox is doing a good job of either just getting spaced or not getting hit. And then it's again, Ifrit's still looking, and now he's kind of out of the percent with a little bit of rage, maybe, where he can combo stuff, so now he's just gotta look for like a raw kill. There's an up air to chip him a little more. Before. Someone needs to come on comms then. Well, I'll be going unfortunately, so goodbye chat. Goodbye Sean, if you're the only one in here. Never mind, I've been told to finish the set. Big T.O. play was very fortunate. And now that up smash. Two stocks too late almost. It's gonna be a big hill to climb for effort to get back in this game a little bit more, but Fox can easily do it with the amount of percent he can rack up. But he's gotta do it before he gets too much on him. Rox is doing a really good job recognizing Rhett's like, or uh, Ifrit's way of getting in. Yeah, look at that, just kind of dashing back around, looking for, dashing around from openings. Wow, that's just gonna take it. Game one going to Roxa. I think they're staying the same characters. It well, sounds like they're going to small battlefield now. Yep, same characters. I like the confidence from Ifrit to stay, even if he was down a bit. I know he's been having a couple of character conflicts recently, but I'm proud of him for sticking. Which is what you need to tough it out sometimes. And now maybe they were doing both a good job of just chipping each other the first stock up to the same amount. He just struggled to kill at the end. Yeah, there's a quick percent on each side, nothing that really leading in the combo until now. Oh, I wonder if he wanted the dash tag after that there. Yeah, now we're getting the little combos going. Nothing huge percent yet, but then like Rox is just throwing out some of these moves that are dealing a big percent. He's not looking for the combos. Good Thundaga to get Fred or Fred away from the ledge. The Zaga, now racking up the damage. Just a raw down smash, missing the jab barely. Nice trying to drop off back air. Yep, Frigga's ready for that one that time, and now it's a re-grab situation. Yeah, almost getting the kill there, but just facing it back. Ooh. Good for the stock. Very afraid taking the lead this time, and now he can start trying to add up the percents. Now he's got to worry. Yep. Look at that extra uh, percent he's getting. A good 60. 
but you can definitely keep adding this up. Oh. The jump back air from Roxa, you know, even things back up stock wise. And honestly, if Roxa can just keep adding a little chip like he's been doing, you should be fine. He does have to worry about straight up airs. Nair up smash probably kills. I want to see Ifrit just rip, wait and rip the up smash. He's just going and he's ripping the jab. I think for the jab lock, but I think I just feel I just go for the up smash at that percent. Sora's fairly light enough to where it would just die. Waiting for the up air, no. Getting the air dodge doesn't get the drift back in for the F smash. Roxa now living at a very dangerous percent here. 130 is nothing to at least uh, not be scared of nine from. Up air, yep, there it is. Late hit dash attack to up air. Now, if it is up a good half a stock. Roxa's got to find a way to get back to what he's doing game one, where he's just kind of being, just, uh, staying away and chipping for the win. Ooh, not getting it down to left that air dodge from Ifrit. But now, just throwing up the down smash. Roxa just kind of feels like he's been really heavy and throwing up these smash attacks. Maybe that's something he needs to look at, like slowing down, because he's being punished for like, a lot of time. Good weight. Oh, but still getting caught by a later up air in the forward air. Now he's in a pretty bad spot. Let's see if he can get back to center. There we go. But he just throws out the Blazaga and he's gonna get punished for it. Just how long it takes. He's gonna get up air. No, not getting an up air. Getting a grab back throw. Good tech from Ifrit. But now there should be a pretty safe punish situation. Yeah, forward smash gonna kill. Yep. And we got ourselves a game three now. Good stuff from Ifrit to stay and then get that uh, kill. And who knows, both game one and two were heavily favored for whoever took the first stock and just kind of got that little bit of a lead. So I imagine that this trend's going to continue on with game three here. Characters, or are we gonna maybe see Kazuya switch? Nope, same characters. Like the resolve from both of them to believe in it and stay. Alright, oh, the Kalos. Very interesting pick. I don't know if Fox would. I feel like Fox would have wanted the ban this just because it's a lot harder to get the kills, but maybe it's just because it's FD. He likes it a bit more. But now. Roxa doing a good job at the start, just kind of getting stray hits to get the chip in. About 30%. Ifrit hasn't gotten anything yet. Wow, I thought we would have gotten up tilt the combo off of that down tilt, but still, forward tilt. Backing up the for helping rack up percent. Ooh, shine. I don't think a shine, you, you utilize shine in this matchup against uh, the Tolerans. Just because Sora can recover from anyway. There's no need not to do it. And now missing the jab lock, facing the wrong direction. Roxa's still ahead in percent, barely. But Ifrit's done a good job evening this back up through the first about minute. Good up smash, but not gonna kill. Probably wouldn't kill in any other stage anyways. And he's just gotta be aware. Roxa with a down B, I think, just trying to predict something. Not going for a down air, just to catch him or something. Waiting. Oh, good wait now. Up smash, just barely out of way. I think he would've had enough time to shield it if it wasn't. Now, good down B. Now, Roxa took the stock lead, so maybe this is... Oh, Ifrit immediately answering with an up smash. Now, things are even. I was going to say, Roxa statistically should win this if they're following the same plan. But, doing a good job already, stock two, getting the early percent lead in. Even the Nair to stop him from getting comboed. Just looking at F smash again, making Brett to let Ifrit to land. I just don't think that's the right play. And then... Ifrit once again missing a potential jab. He was just too low percent for it to put uh, in the tumble. Back throw. Good recovery above the thunder. And now Red's got or Ifrit's got to just put the chip, and he needs about another 50 before he can look to kill. Only one get you about 10 right now, and Rockhead might just be waiting patiently to find his moment to get the uh, few more percent in to kill. Up smash might have taken it if he landed. A good awareness from Ifrit to jump away. Now things getting really scary. Dash attack up here, not gonna kill just yet. Welcome, lazy. Very close game three. 
with Rox, who just took the uh, second stock. And if they're following the trend, that means he should win this game. That's how the last few games have been. Whoever took the first stock ends up winning it. Uh, still looking for his uh, up smashes from there. Put okay. out there. Yeah. Oh. He's not gonna get it. Even if he ran up, I don't think he got it. There's enough drift away, and I think it's high enough percent. Yeah. Oh. He's just gotta look for the stray hit. He keeps he keeps fetching for his up smash. He just gotta he's at the percent where I think he has to get the stray kill. There we like go. That back air. He's back air. Get him back in the game. But he still has sixty percent he needs to get back if he wants to make things close to even. Holy oh, crap. That's kinda of what Rox has been doing all game, throwing out these F smashes. And Fox is light enough. Smashes. Ooh, good avoidance of the thunder. Oh, nice oh, grab. Yeah. Recovery. Oh, oh, good back air. I would have. I thought he was just gonna drop down and uh, revenge though. again. Yeah, not revenge, but down the Good spot dodge. You just gotta be aware that he's almost at up, like up airing combo percent. Good two or three. That was just really high though. Yeah, that's what I said earlier. Is that he's probably not gonna kill, but it's just gonna rack up the percent. Oh, Smash. Whoa. No. Just back 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 kill. Good. Oh, oh just hit by the thing. Wow. Damn. Congrats to Rocka. Rocks had taken that nail butter thing. Yeah, unfortunately, I gotta go play my set.